smashing car windows in downtown with a handful of rocks. Ten News anchor Mary McKenzie joining us live. Mary, police say as they were trying to take that man into custody, he threw a rock at a police dog. The police dog is okay. Fortunately, that's the good news. He took a bite out of the suspect as he was trying to take him down. But you can see the damage to one of the cars parked right in front of the police station here. Uh, the passenger side window has some damage and the front windshield is completely smashed. Let's get you to some video, though, from about 3 o'clock this morning. Uh, thanks to that bite from the police dog, the suspect's now at the hospital and apparently not being very cooperative. During the arrest, they had to put a spit bag on this guy. They don't know whether he's under the influence or suffering from mental illness, possibly both, they tell me. It's too early to tell, but all this playing out right in front of the police station and at the station itself, he hit uh, one of the windows of the station. We saw bulletproof glass, they tell me, so it'll be expensive to fix, plus the four cars vandalized outside the station, parked on all the adjacent streets. There's a van with a back window knocked completely out. The others have similar damage to the car we just showed you. They say the guy also threw a rock at a city college police sergeant who was on the phone with SDPD trying to help him catch this guy. So that's uh, two charges of assault on an officer. The other one, of course, for hitting the canine officer with the rock, plus the charges of vandalism. We're live downtown. Mary McKenzie, 10 News.